All right. So in this video, we can see how we can contribute to the NPSP open source community. So what is open source? Open source means this NPSP project, it's open to anybody who wants to add code to it. So let me show you, if I go to the NPSP GitHub and go here, you can actually see the codes that make the NPSP um, package. You cannot see it from the um, Salesforce org because it is a managed package, right? So if you go on here and then you go to your org, let me give an example, hands on org here. And I'm going to launch my NPSP playground with the NPSP already installed. As with all managed packages, if I go to setup, you cannot see the code. Um, if I go Apex classes, for example, here, and you will see this namespace is NPSP, right? So for example, this account merge TDTM, if you click on it, you can't see anything. You can't see the code. You can not see the code because it is a managed package. This is how Salesforce managed package is protected. You can't see it, but because NPSP is an open source community, you, you can see the code in their GitHub repository. So the, for classes, it's under source or SRC. I'm just showing this. You don't have to understand what's going on in the classes and stuff. And you can see all this stuff going on here, right? For example, if you want to see the objects, uh, all the fields, the metadata, you can see from there. The classes, you can see from here. That particular class, account, account merge TDTM class, now you can see the code here, right? Right? You can learn, oh, this is how you create lists. This is how you do loop. This is how you, anything you wanna learn how to, how, how to connect the dots, so to speak. And then you can further develop. You can make NPSP gold, whoa, or the super NPSP package or NPSP, whatever your version is, you can add stuff to it, modify it, and you can call it a fork, your own version of NPSP, and it is still going to be open source and other people can use what you have added or modified by installing your modified version. So that is an open source, which is awesome, right? And as you learn to develop and further your skills, I do encourage you to learn developing. You know, it's fun just to learn new stuff. Just enjoy it one step at a time. So another thing, we can go to the Power of Us Hub, Power of Us Hub, which is where all the um, nonprofit community hangs out. So you can log in with Salesforce there allow okay so once you're in you need to go through the joining process so to speak i'm going to accept and then my role is you know academic pro no i'm actually what non-profit right non-profit i am sys admin it Mission is to teach you guys. Um, hmm. Well, I'm faith-based. This is my nonprofit org. Let's see that. I'm just gonna skip this so I don't get some marketing emails. Um, yada yada yada. Following, following. Take me to the hub. Boom! Now you're in the hub, right? You can complete your chapter profile. Follow topics that interest you and learn more. I'm gonna hide this for now. So what can you do? You can submit ideas. You can um, go to topics, you know, and learn about stuff here. Help other people. Write an answer for other people. 
knowledge. You can read articles, lots of stuff. And here's basically what you can do. You can report a bug, join a community project, share an idea, answer a question, contribute documentation. You can contribute documentation and attend a community sprint. Whoa, read this up. This is awesome. Adding it all up. I'm going to read this for you. This is a good paragraph. If you have made your way to this point, unit by unit through the Administer Nonprofit Success Pack Trail, you have absorbed an incredible amount of information. From big picture best practices to the nittiest of grittiest for specific settings. And you are well on your way to living up to your chosen status. You are chosen. As you continue on, remember you can return to this trail whenever you need to. And you can replay all my videos many, many times whenever you need to. And I'm going to keep going. There are more for NPSP. There are a few more things that's not covered in this trail yet, which I'm going to cover and then you're done. The how to's and resources will be here for you and the videos It's always going to be there forever. And don't forget about the power of us hub. It is always available for you 24 seven ask stuff here, right? Topics and then choose when you are, what you, what topic you want to ask and then you can ask people here the people are very active the community and they will respond to you fast that's it let's do the quiz NPSP is distributed as a type of software that encourage exchange collaboration and transparency it's an open source project true or false community members can submit features ideas yes to the NPSP development team that is correct true so you have completed this particular administer NPSP trail. Congratulations. You did a great job and you can do everything. Okay. The key is never get overwhelmed. Don't let yourself to get overwhelmed. Keep learning one step at a time. You know, before you know it, you're mastering it more than you think you can. I'll see you on the next sections. Bada bing, bada boom. Oop, <laughs> keep forgetting my woohoo, my woohoo. I'll see you on the next session. Bada bing, bada boom. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce app exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word, watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing! Bada boom.